Hey guys, welcome to FHN Today TV. Today is Wednesday, August 11th, and it's the first day of school. Today in our episode, we have for you a tour of Howe North, and we have a closer look into Freshman Transition Day and the jobs the mentors have. So we're going to take you on a tour of FHN. First up, we have the office. Now this is where you're going to want to go if you ever miss a day of school and you need to drop off a note. Up next we have the nurse's office, which is where you're going to come if, clearly, you ever don't feel really good. And this is the really important one. It is the guidance office. Now this is where you're going to want to go if you ever have a scheduling conflict or a problem or something like that. Okay, so now we have the commons. And this is where you're going to be eating lunch, as you found out on transition day. All right, so this is what we call the science wing. And this is where, obviously, you're going to find all of your science classes. All right, guys, so here we have um, our new construction. We're going to be getting some new science labs, and they're going to be opening up in December. So you should be really excited about getting to use those. So coming up over here, as I mentioned earlier, we have our art wing. This is, of course, where you're going to find all of your art classes. All right, so something cool about the art wing also is that a lot of times you're going to find students' artwork posted up, and there's actually a whole bunch of murals over here, which you don't really find anywhere else in the school. Now, over here, we have our library. Now, this is going to be a really great tool to use. All right, all right guys, so here we have Mrs. Gunnell. She is one of the 10 people you need to know from the North Star, and we are going to ask her some questions about what it's like to be a librarian here at North. All right, so what are some good ways for freshmen to utilize the library here at North? Well, the library is here for a number of reasons. Um, first of all, we're here to promote reading. And if there is a book that you're interested in, we probably have it. And even if you think that you don't like to read, we probably have a book that you would enjoy. Another thing that we do here is teach how to research well. And you will have to do lots of research in high school. So we'll help you out with that. So what are some kind of other perks that the students might not know about that you guys offer here? Well, one of the things that we have a, a nice newer area where we have soft chairs and we have magazines and newspapers that kids can just pick up and read at any time. We have a chess set and we welcome kids to just come here and sit and read a magazine or enjoy a game of chess. All right guys, so there you have it. So as you may have seen the paper, we have something called the butterfly hallway and the butterfly bypass system that you guys can use to avoid it. So over here is where the butterfly hallway is. This is where you're going to find a lot of traffic in between classes and especially during lunch periods. Um, but if you go and you follow this all the way around, you can actually bypass all of that traffic and that's what we call the butterfly bypass. Really two really important rooms that you're going to want to know about is the PC lab and the Mac lab. The PC lab is also called the Math and Science lab and this is where we have a lot of our more like technical like math and science programs. Now something nice about the Mac lab that we have is that there is always some sort of teacher in here who is willing to help you with your papers. Um, a lot of times cl English classes will come in here when they have like writing days for their essays. So as I mentioned that there are some times that you just can't avoid the butterfly hallway at all. Um, some of those instances is when you have a class in the hallway. Um, a lot of the English classes are over here. So also what you're gonna wanna know over here is that we have these really nice set of stairs that if you're trying to avoid traffic, these are the ones you need to go on. So we are gonna to go to the third level and check out what you can find up there. Alright, so that is one of our bypass staircases that you're going to want to be able to know about. So, this is the top floor. Um, a lot of times what you're going to find up here is math classes. Math classes are up here. Very important. Going to want to know about this. But also, as I mentioned earlier, we have some of all the foreign language classes are up here. And this is where you're going to find um, so most of your math classes is like in this hallway and you will also find your upper level Spanish, Mr. Santos, 
is right down here. And there is one history teacher that you should know about who's up here. Her name is Miss Davis. She teaches all of the freshman honors history. Coming up, this is another one of our butterfly bypass staircases. Um, it might seem a little out of the way at first, but you're gonna find that it will save you a whole bunch of time. Um, also down here is where you're going to find some of your freshman and sophomore history classes. So now that we've shown you the upper two floors, let's head on downstairs. Alrighty, so here we are downstairs. This is part of our butterfly bypass system. Um, this can get you under that massive butterfly hallway very quickly because it's never as crowded because it's down here and most of these are elective classes. All right, so right around this corner, we have both of our gyms. This is the small gym. Um, just down here at those black doors is where our big gym is. Also, this is where the activities office is and this is an office that you are gonna want to get to know very well. This is what we call the drama, music, and band hallway. Um, this is clearly where you're going to find any drama class, any choir class, any band class that you're taking. Alright, so down this side of the school is where you are going to find all of your facts classes and all of the business classes. This is the business department. Um, so we're going to find all your marketing classes. Right, so another room that you will probably need to know about is room 23. This is room 23. Now, you will not have any classes in here, but if you have been a naughty student, this is where most of the time you will be getting your detentions. All right, guys, that concludes our tour. I hope you enjoyed learning a little bit more about FHN. See you later. On August 10th, freshmen showed up to school for transition day. They were greeted by their mentors as they walked into school. I think it's helpful so they get a, like, they go into transition day knowing where they're going and they're not as scared and they can talk to us and get to know a little bit about high school. Freshmen proceeded to go to the big gym where they heard a speech from Mr. Little and Dr. Jones. Now, a lot of you are wondering, am I in the right place today? We've just been looking forward to having you here today. We're so excited to have you join us. While in the big gym, freshmen also play games. Okay, now Aaron, take one step, one step forward. Freshmen then found their mentors and broke off into small groups to get to know each other better. No! No! no. Sorry. Oh my god. Okay. That's good. One. After they broke up into small groups, freshmen then proceeded to either go to lunch or go to a club fair where they could find out different activities that they could per participate in during the year. I think it will be uh, much easier having mentors uh, because when I have questions, I can go and ask them. Alright guys, thanks for watching. This is a Hal North production. See you next time.